We just wrapped up at a crazy auction. The real estate market in 2021 is absolutely insane. We're gonna tell you what it went for, what we would have done with it, and how high we went. As always, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and stay to the end to find out exactly what the property went for. Guys, right here, there's about 150 cars all the way down the street. The auction doesn't start for another 20 minutes. It's insane what's going on right now. So what we're going to look at right now is a eight unit apartment complex in downtown Murfreesboro. The bigger play here is a redevelopment opportunity. So if you take the eight units, you rent them for a little bit, and then as you're taking that, I think you can put eight to 10 new construction townhomes or smaller single family on it. That is the real play to maximize the deal. We always talk about, you know, what's the highest and best use for a property. And that's what we're gonna go see what we can get. Who knows, this thing may go for a million dollars. Think right now, the max bid that I'm gonna probably be at is maybe 800, but we'll, we'll just have to see where we're at. Survey, where the property's located all the vacancy information for the property. What it's renting for right now is 2,300 a month. It doesn't cash flow at all. It's not a great play for just the rental, but again, I think the development. guys this is probably one of the worst i've seen in a while I, I don't know we can go that high the max bid that i'm gonna probably be at is maybe 800 800 might be way too high because as it sits right now it's it's really really bad we may end up only going as high as four but we're gonna try and make money on the deal if we can't we move on to the next one don't ever try and force a deal ever <music> Hey guys, so we're over here. We're getting ready to start the auction. The inside was a lot worse than I thought. To be honest with you, this is probably a teardown. We're just looking at it at dirt value right now. I think we just saw the survey and we could put eight new units on here. We're hoping it stays under 400. They're starting the bid at 100K. They have an online bid right now at 200. So we're just gonna go from there. There's a lot of looky loos and people kicking, kicking tires around, but um, it's really kind of looking at seeing the million dollar What's houses across, across the street. you see across the street, there's probably one and a half and one and a half on each one of those. So it's a really good redevelopment opportunity. I just, we'll see. We're not gonna buy a bad deal. And we tried to get this before the auction. It's a brother and sister who inherited it. And they're just really intrigued by the auction process to see how much it'll bring. So, you know, can't blame them for that. So in an auction, so normally you have to put a 10% buyer's premium on top of the sales price. And then also you have to put 10% day of, and it's no contingencies at all. So you gotta close cash very quickly. So if this sells at 400, our purchase price is 440. That $40,000 we need to submit within 24 hours of winning the auction, and it is 100% non-refundable, but it does go towards that 440 it purchase is, price. It is only refundable if they don't clear title. Exactly. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I feel like this is only the land value. Dirt, dirt play on We feel like we can exit around 2.4 million, so we pay 20% for the land. So we're gonna start at 480. We won't be back, ladies and gentlemen. Don't call us tomorrow to try to buy it. It'll be too late. 225, two and a half. A 225 here, we're gonna go 250 here, we're gonna go two and a half, 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 half. 250 here, now 275. A 250 here, we're gonna go 75, five, 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 five. Here, we're gonna go 275. 275. 350, 350 with Dave, 350 with Dave. 375, 375, Charlie's in, write it down. 75, 800, uh, 400 here. I got 375 with Charlie. 400, a 380. I don't ever remember that. All right, I'm 400 with John, 385 with Charlie, 400, 405 with Calvert, 400, uh, what you got, 405, 405 with John, I got 410 with Charlie, now 425, 525, 425, here we go, 425, 400, 400, I got 425 with John Calvert, 425 here, 
430, 430 with Charlie. 430, 440, 440. 440 with John. Here we go. 440 with John Crawford. 445, 545, 545. How much? 450 with Charlie. 450 here. Now 460. A 450 here. Here we go. 60 here. Here we go. 460. Down a little bit. Here we go. 460. Go 460. 460. Thank you, John. 460. 460. 460. 460. 470. Here we go. 470. I'm 460 with John Carver. 470. A 470 here. That premium's too. Yeah, we're going to stop. Hey, we go. 470. Hey, we go. 465. Where are we at? 465. Do 465 one time. I'm 460,000. John Carver. Right here. Somebody. Woo, me. Somebody ordered dinner. Charlie's in, 465, 470, a 465, down dollar bid, here we go, 470, down dollar bid, here we go, 470, 470, Covert's in, a 470, 470 here, 470 yeah. here, here we go, 470, 475, a 475, 475, here we go, 475, here we go, 475, here we go, 475, a 470 here, here we go, 75, 475, Charlie, one time, 475, well you, John, right here, 470, so here's the deal, 480, John, this land, is worth about 480. 480 so it's already at 480. 480 so what that means is you're going to add a 10 percent premium to 480 and then that puts you out of the market of being 530 grand you're over half a million just to tear that thing down when i first got here we hadn't walked through it i thought we were going to 800. i was ready to do it i was ready to go to 800. It's dirt walk, value only. We walk through it and it's dirt value only. The property is just not worth it. So we dropped our price down to 480. We went up to 525. Yeah. It's still going right now at 630. We'll see if it ends up coming back Just out. went 630. At 630 with 10% premium, they're at 690. That puts it around 120 to 150 over dirt value. And here's the big thing with that deal. If you tear it down, it resorts back to the original zoning, which is just three houses. The play at this point, I guess, is to rehab one at a time. It has to be a slumlord. I mean, because our quad that we took you to last week is like one, one street which over Which we'll right link here. that video as well for you. It'll be linked in the comments, but they got two about $1 million houses right across the street. So that was the ultimate play here. The ultimate play as we talked about it was to end up building three over a million dollar homes and it would really have worked. But again, stick to your numbers, make sure that the deal works for you. If it doesn't, walk away. That's it. I mean, Eric does this all over Nashville and 20% lot value of your build, your building projecting price is where you want to be. The total of that auction that we just left, just got the final text, was 726. And that included the 10% buyer's premium. It's just crazy right now, guys. It's absolutely crazy. I just, I think that the land value was, was all that that was worth, but you know, hey, what do I know? I'm just a real estate investor. As always, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and leave us a comment.